Hello friends, welcome to A to Z industry. This video focuses on important MCQs related to gingiva. Circular epithelium is highly permeable, semi-permeable, non-permeable, none of the above. Semi-permeable. Circular epithelium is semi-permeable. Stippling is seen on marginal gingiva, attached gingiva, interdented gingiva, none of the above. Attached gingiva. Stippling is a form of adaptive specialization. It is a feature of healthy gingiva and it is absent in infancy and old age. Junctional epithelium is attached to enamel by reticular fibers, desmosomes, hemidesmosomes, collagen. Hemidesmosomes. Junctional epithelium attached to enamel by hemidesmosomes. The length of junctional epithelium ranges from 0.25 to 1.35 mm. Then, junctional epithelium is attached to tooth by basal lamina. The area which is most prone to infection. Marginal gingiva, circular epithelium, interdental col, attached gingiva. Interdental col. Interdental col is most prone to infection. Gingival col is non keratinized keratinized, parakeratinized, orthokeratinized. Non-keratinized. Gingival call is non-keratinized. Gingiva in children. More keratinized, more stippled. More keratinized, less stippled. Less keratinized, more stippled. Less keratinized, less stippled. Less keratinized, less stippled. Least width of attached gingiva is found on Facial aspect of lateral incisor, canine, first premolar, second premolar. First premolar. Greatest width of attached gingiva present in incisor region. 3.5 to 4.5 mm in maxilla and 3.3 to 3.9 mm in mandible. Least width of attached gingiva present in first premolar area. 1.9 mm in maxilla and 1.8 mm in mandible. Adequacy of width of attached gingiva can be determined by roll test, tension test, Schiller's potassium iodide, all of the above. All of the above. Bartonian line, a type of gingival pigmentation due to carbide intoxication, bismuth intoxication, lead intoxication, mercury intoxication. Lead intoxication. Bartonian lines due to lead intoxication. Gingivitis starts at the marginal gingiva, attached gingiva, papillary gingiva, all of the above. Papillary gingiva. Which of the following type of cells are absent in junctional epithelium? Langerhans cells, Merkel cells, melanocytes, keratinosomes. Langerhans cells. Langerhans cells absent in junctional epithelium. Okay, it's all about the topic gingiva. See you with a new video. Thank you.